Okay, so I've been trying to connect a micro bit to an Android phone via Bluetooth so that you can flash programs from the Android phone onto the micro bit. And there seem to be some problems. It's not very intuitive, I've found. And, you know, you search around a few forums and there's lots of people on there going, how does this work? This doesn't seem to work for me. I keep on getting this GAT error or connection errors. Uh, it's just not connecting properly. Now, I've been using the Samsung Microbit app, which seems to work fine, except for this connection thing when you're flashing the programs to the Microbit. So you can create your programs fine, and you get a list of the programs you've created in the app, but the problem is flashing the programs to the Microbit. Uh, now, one of the things which I have found, um, which kind of was a bit confusing, if you're using the MicroPython language on the Samsung uh, Microbit app, it's it just won't work now there's a technical reason for this uh, i found that actually the uh, bluetooth module uh, in micropython is too big it's and it's not set by default so you you'd have to change the configuration of how the micropython actually compiles to the hex file to include bluetooth which is not the current default so that that's kind of why it's not going to work that way it just doesn't fit in the memory but if you're using blocks uh, the the microsoft blocks program then that actually will enable you to include the bluetooth module which it needs to do the flashing and that will enable it to uh, to connect properly so if you have used micropython to flash a uh, program to the uh, micro bit either via Bluetooth or via a cable, then you will not be able to connect between Android and the micro bit anymore. You won't be able to put the micro bit into pairing mode because there's no Bluetooth module installed at that point. What you need to do is you need to flash a blank program uh, down a cable uh, from a computer using the blocks program to flash a hex file. And then after that, you'll be able to put it into pairing mode uh, because the Bluetooth module is available with the Blocks X programs. So this is what we do to get this working every time. Now this is only available with Blocks. First of all, pair the micro bit with the phone or reconnect using the pairing process on the micro bit if you've already paired the micro bit to your phone. So you've got to get a connection first before you do anything. To pair the micro bit, press the A and B buttons together, and then whilst holding those down, press the reset button until the words pairing mode scrolls across the LED matrix. Then you can pair the Android phone with the micro bit through the app or reconnect. Okay, write your code in the blocks program on your phone and then use the download button to save it to the list of programs which appear in the app. Now to flash the program to the micro bit, go to the flash section on the app and then put the micro bit into pairing mode again. Then select the program to flash on the app. Then the app will connect and transfer the program to the micro bit. Then to flash another program, just put the micro bit back into pairing mode and select the program to flash on the app. Now the point with this is you don't actually need to have a connection between the Android phone and the micro bit when you start flashing the app. You just have to have it in pairing mode. 